Captain America's modern-day quest for the perfect selfie. Captain America Steve Rogers had seen it all. He had fought Nazis in World War II, battled aliens with the Avengers, and even taken on his best friend turned assassin. But today, he faced his most daunting challenge yet, taking the perfect selfie. It all started one sunny afternoon at Avengers Tower. Tony Stark, Iron Man himself, was throwing a party to celebrate another successful Save the World mission. Everyone was there, Thor with his mighty hammer, Black Widow looking as fierce as ever, and Hulk trying not to break the furniture. Even Rocket and Groot had come down from the Guardians of the Galaxy for some earthly fun. As Steve mingled, he noticed everyone pulling out their phones, snapping selfies and sharing them on social media. He watched Thor strike a pose with Mjolnir, his biceps glistening, while Rocket perched on Groot's shoulder, giving a cheeky thumbs up. Steve scratched his head, feeling a bit left out. Hey, Tony, Steve called out, cornering the tech genius who was busy taking a selfie with an adoring fan. I think it's time I got with the times. Can you show me how to take one of these, uh, selfies? Tony's eyes sparkled with mischief. Cap, I thought you'd never ask. You're about to become the next Instagram sensation. Tony handed Steve a sleek new smartphone. First things first, Tony said. You need a catchy handle. How about the real cap? Steve nodded, fumbling with the phone. Sounds good. Now, how do I work this thing? Tony spent the next hour trying to teach Steve the basics of selfie taking. They started with lighting. Always find good lighting, Tony instructed. Natural light is best. Steve tried posing near a window, but the sun was too bright. His first selfie was more squinting than smiling. Tony laughed. Maybe not directly into the sun cap. Next, they moved on to angles. Hold the phone up high, but not too high, or you'll look like a bobblehead, Tony explained. Steve's next attempt had him looking like he was peering into a spaceship. Okay, let's try some filters, Tony suggested, demonstrating the various options. Steve's eyes widened as he cycled through filters that turned him into a puppy, a bunny, and even a rainbow. Tony, these are ridiculous, Steve exclaimed, though he couldn't help but chuckle at the sight of himself as a dog. Just having fun, Cap. Now for the real deal. Expressions. Give me a classic smile, a smoldering look, and oh, try duck face. Steve's smile was perfect, but his smolder looked more like he was constipated, and duck face, well, let's just say it was more of a chicken face. The other Avengers, noticing the impromptu selfie session, gathered around to watch. You need props, yelled Rocket, tossing Steve a Captain America shield. Great idea, Tony agreed. Try holding the shield. Steve struck a pose with the shield, trying to look heroic. He felt silly, but the Avengers cheered him on. Even Hulk attempted a selfie, though his massive fingers kept blocking the camera. Why don't we all take one together, Natasha suggested, pulling everyone into a group. Steve was relieved. Group selfies seemed easier. They crowded together, smiling and making funny faces. Just as Tony was about to snap the picture, Thor's hammer slipped and knocked over a vase, sending everyone into fits of laughter. Perfect, Tony exclaimed, capturing the candid moment. Steve looked at the picture. It wasn't perfect in the conventional sense, but it was full of joy and camaraderie. He decided it was good enough for his first post. Okay, what do I say? Steve asked, ready to share his picture with the world. Keep it simple, Tony advised. How about having a blast with my superhero family, Avengers Assemble? Steve typed it in, hit post, and waited. Within seconds, likes and comments started pouring in. Fans were thrilled to see Captain America embracing the selfie trend. As the party continued, Steve found himself more comfortable with his phone. He took selfies with everyone, Thor flexing his muscles, Natasha doing her signature scowl and even Hulk, who managed a gentle smile. Each picture captured a moment of their incredible lives and the bonds they shared. By the end of the night, Steve had become a selfie pro, or at least a competent amateur. He looked at his feed, filled with happy memories, and smiled. He might be a man out of time, but today he felt more connected than ever. Not bad for an old-timer, huh? Steve said, nudging Tony. Not bad at all, Tony replied. Welcome to the 21st century, Cap. 
Steve laughed, feeling a sense of accomplishment. He might never fully understand all the technology and trends of the modern world, but he knew one thing for sure. No matter the era, it was the people and the moments that truly mattered. And now, he had the selfies to prove it.